Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? Silky Creamy in the house. Back for another special video. And we're going to do something a little different today. And uh, we're not going to be doing a shave soap um, review, but actually, we're going to be doing a review on a not really a bar soap, but a soap um, product. And so, um, first off, uh, this is from Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. Uh, I, I picked up a bunch of different stuff from them and they got some really cool things there and I never heard of African black soap and so I ordered it and I want to take a look at it and so anyway um, I also ordered this is a um, agave uh, exfoliating uh, soap uh, I don't know what you guys call this some people call it soap socks um, some people call it a um, soak um soap um jockey or whatever um but this is a bag that you can put your bar soap in and use to uh exfoliate as uh, as you know um so i thought that would show this off since you're doing a bar soap but really the review is going to be on the galactic african black soap and um it has a very unique um appearance and as you can see here it is a soap but it has a unique color and um yeah so anyway just wanted to do a review on this this is the the label and so in here you have honey oh shea butter Osun, which is cam wood, palm kernel oil, cocoa pod ash, palm bunch ash, aloe vera, lime juice, and water. So, very interesting. So, it's got oil, but it's also got ash. Um, and I think the ash is probably for exfoliating. Um, but, I mean... I don't know. Maybe this is the way they used to make soaps back in the day. I don't know. Um, but they put ash in the soap. Um, but very interesting. So it has like a slight like fudge. Um, it's hard. But not like, it's not rock hard, but it's very, very firm. Very firm. Um, it's a hard soap and then this part is open here and then this is um, kind of oily um, but yeah you guys can see that so there's burnt matter in here along with oil and um, yeah this is like real African um, soap so anyway I'm gonna go ahead and read off the um, website because the website gives a lot of information so it says boom straight from west africa folks african black soap truly magical stuff that deserves a home in your shave den what raw and pure traditional african black soap is from western africa the texture of the soap is soft and at times it is a bit crumbly but never hard like regular bar soap Natural raw black soap doesn't have artificial fragrance and has a natural earthy scent. African black soap is revered for having skin nourishing benefits due to an abundance of antioxidants. The soap is made from the ashes of plantain skin, cocoa pod, and palm leaves, and palm oil from leaves or kernels. Some additional ingredients depending on the makers of the soap could be honey to soften skin and shea butter or cocoa butter for extra moisturizing properties. Some black soap is more potent than others and can be drying. In the case of our galactic African soap, it goes above and beyond containing honey, cocoa butter, shea butter, and aloe vera. African black soap is kind of a darling currently in skincare and has been reported to. It alleviates razor bumps. It is often used by men during shaving because of the high shea butter content, which protects the skin. Secondly, reduces inflammation and skin irritations. Black soap helps reduce inflammation and skin irritations. 
It is soothing on dry and irritated skin, relieving dry patches, rashes, and red areas. Thirdly, uh, protects against photoaging. Antioxidants in black soap protect the skin from free radical damage, which is a cause of premature skin aging, wrinkles, and facial lines. Fourthly, improves skin tone. Black soap firms and tones skin and improves skin texture for more supple and glowing skin. Fifth, fades skin's skin discolorations. Black soap helps even out and fades brown spots and discoloration. Sixth, helps problem skin. It can help with blemishes. Users have said that black soap helps with blackheads and can soothe irritated skin. Seven, has deep cleansing action. Black soap is great for deep pore cleansing. It also is effective at removing makeup because of the oils and butters. And lastly, it's an effective exfoliant. The ashes in black soap provide exfoliating properties to remove dead skin cells and thereby improve free fine lines, soften and rejuvenate rough skin. So more about black soap, plantain skins and leaves have a high concentration of iron and vitamins A and E. Vitamin E helps with tish, tissue structure, is healing and helps moisturize the skin, improving texture and tone. Vitamin A benefits collagen production. Allantoin in the leaves of plantain stimulates the growth of new skin cells. Cocoa butter softens and firms the skin, has antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties to fight against free radicals, repair damaged skin, and renew skin cells. Cocoa butter is a natural fat extracted from the uh, cacao bean. It's been used for years as a moisturizer. It has vitamins A and E to fight against environmental damage, and therefore, the signs of aging, it helps the skin retain moisture and improves elasticity. So anyway, um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. So this is actually made in Ni Nigeria, which is very, very interesting, but it's packaged in Arizona. So it's estimated to be five ounces, typically weighing in more due to being hand cut. But I thought it was pretty interesting. I think I'm going to try this out. Um, Obviously, this is something that you wouldn't use, in my opinion, just because of the smell. It has a, yeah, it does have an earthy and not like a ash uh, burnt uh, uh, scent to it. Um, this is something you'd use at home just to like, you know, during the week while you're home. You wouldn't use it while going out. But maybe and in the evening when you take your uh, evening shower, before you go to bed, you can put this on. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, something interesting something new and um yeah i'll be putting it in this nice agave bag and i also picked up at the same time um they have this uh four headed brush stand i needed something for all my brushes so they have this also um which i like because it's fat because usually the handles that we have are fat right so anyway so yeah just wanted to show you guys that Hope you guys have a great day and a great week. And as always, take care of each other and make sure to bring people up and don't bring people down, you know. So anyway, take care. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Peace.